ہر مدد مولا رضا اے میرے مولا رضا ہر مدد مولا رضا اے میرے مولا رضا ہر مدد مولا رضا اے میرے مولا رضا اے غریب الغربا اے میرے مولا رضا اے غریب الغربا اے میرے مولا رضا اے غریب الغربا اے میرے مولا رضا آپ ہیں روح علی آپ ہیں روح علی آپ جانے زہرا اے میرے مولا رضا اے غریب الغربا اے میرے مولا رضا اے غریب السلام علیکم I'm Mohsin Asharia and I'm here in Iran with the World Federation. The World Federation runs two some short summer courses in Iran for Bible ilm for ages 14 to 17 and Medinatul ilm from ages 18 to 24. The students stay and study in the holy city of Qom. They also visit other cities such as Tehran, Hamadan and Mashhad. During these trips as well as Ziyarat The campers also visit cultural sites and parks. During the evenings, the students usually go shopping or visit the haram. However, there was also time to socialize, to play sports and visit tourist attractions. The camp brings the youth of our community together and we get a chance to make new friends. This year, we were fortunate enough to meet many miraja and ulama who advised us on how to lead our lives. Many students were inspired by the scholars. One particular camper would like to share with us how the camp has inspired him to make changes to his lifestyle. I'm now here with Ali Reza Kimji. Ali Reza, how has this trip inspired you to change? This trip has um, been many ways of inspiration for all the youths. Um, one of my personal changes were that I wanted, really wanted to quit smoking and alhamdulillah I have achieved that goal. The other ones were meeting the ulemas. Um, they have really inspired me personally to do for the Islamic studies and um, to get closer to Allah. So would you recommend the course to others? Yes, definitely. Um, this course has been very well organized. Um, I would recommend every youth in our community to participate. During the camp, the campers were taught akhlaq, aqaid, ahkam, Islam in politics and Quran recitation. As the camp aims to provide a basic understanding of Islam, Sister Nusat Ismail takes us through her views about how the trip went for her. Okay, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Nusat Ismail and I'm from Birmingham. Um, to sum up everything I've learned in the past three weeks would be incredibly difficult to do because we have gained so much and it's very hard to put into words exactly how much. Starting with the lessons that were organized for us, um, for example the Akkad lessons have really allowed me to strengthen that foundation of Tawheed onto which everything else builds on. Um, we were also fortunate enough to have many lectures organized for us and every single lecture in its own way was so inspirational, so thought-provoking and definitely you know, inspired some changes in myself. Um, and not only that, also the girls I've been living with for the past few weeks, they've become like my sisters and the mentors as well. And I've learned so much from that as well, be it through their kindness, through their generosity, through the patience that they've displayed throughout the trip. And um, I'm really grateful to have met all these amazing girls as well and um, inshallah we'll keep in touch in the future. Brother Yasser was spiritually uplifted after visiting the harem of Bibi Matsuma and he shares his feelings with us. I'm now going to speak to Yasser from Wessex Jamaat. Yasser, what, have, what benefits have you gained from visiting this holy shrine? My heart really opened when I came here because there are thousands of Shias. We're all surrounded by Shias and coming for one purpose, uh, meeting, uh, coming for the Jara of Sayyidah Matsuma. And uh, it really... Uh, touched me and I think I'm going to get better and my spirituality will improve by coming to visit this place as it is full of benefits and I really love the atmosphere especially when the, the duas and the namaz al jamaat we recite behind the ayatollahs and all that. Another sister had some worries before embarking on the journey. However, towards the end she relishes having come on the trip and now encourages her fellow youth to come and experience Iran. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My name is Sakina Jiwa from Kenya. And uh, I just want to say a few words about this trip, which has been so, so amazing. From the starting of the trip when I came here, I was just wondering how will I you know, cope up with everything, living with perfect strangers for three weeks, 
being with or like going according to schedule alhamdulillah shukar khuda jo i have been doing some everything so well staying with everybody so well everybody's being so nice to be the mentors the, the people i've been living with everyone takes such good care of everyone i would recommend every single girl every single participant every single child on earth to come for this trip this trip has been so amazing going to hamadan and the waterfalls was so amazing going to the um, alisadar cave was so good it showed me the um, the nature of allah it, it made me feel the presence of allah and going to jump quran on tuesdays felt so good made me feel the presence of imam zamana we felt like he was right there sitting next to us everything was so good i recommend everybody to come for this trip it is really good i want to thank everybody i want to thank the world federation for organizing this trip it is really wonderful thank you everybody thank you so much alhamdulillah we've come to the end of the three week course here in qom in mashhad we ask allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept our ziyara and we ask our imam and lady masuma to invite all those viewers who wish to attend who wish to visit their holy shrines to grant them the ability to do so wassalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh शान चलो देखने शान चलो दिल ये कहता है चलो हा खुरासान चलो खुरासान चलो बस खुरासान में है बस खुरासान में है खुल्द की आब हवा है मेरे मौल रजा है गरीबुल गुरबा मेरे मौल रजा है गरीबुल मुफ्ती को बुरा किस मुफ्ती को बुरा हर नफस दिल से मेरे यही आती है सदा यही आती है सदा तुम हो कुरान मेरा तुम हो कुरान मेरा तुम ही मेरा काबा है मेरे मौल रजा है गरीबुल गुर